Welcome back to Brickmania TV. You have a new model for us. Yeah, I'm Dan Siskin. This is, and this Dan is Landon. Lando. Lando, Lando, not Landon. And this is a new tank. It is. Well, it's not new. This is an old tank. Well, so it's, it's new to me. Yeah, this is the Renault FT, or sometimes called the FT17. Yeah. Um, we've done this before. This is this is sort of a, you know, the the, the chorus of bring back the Renault, mm -hmm. bring back the Mark V, bring back all these old yeah. World War One kits. It's 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 coming to a crescendo, and we're doing a preview. This is. Yeah. This, is this the French version or is this the American version? This is the French version. This is the so, French version. Cool. So anybody who's not familiar with this, the Renault is one of the first tanks ever made. Um, in fact, this last week was the 100th anniversary nice. of the tanks participating in battle, World mm -hmm. War I. Um, so kind of appropriate that we're bringing back a tank, bringing back a tank kit. Um, it is a Renault. Renault. FT. I think that stands for light tank in some sort of French language. <laughs> so basically, we have a light tank. It's, this is a traditional tank. You have driver down low, uh, gunner, commander up on top. So turreted tank has a gun. This version mm -hmm. has the small, uh, it's like a small artillery piece. They had another version of this tank that had a machine gun mounted in it. Which machine gun was that? Uh, a French one. A French one. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sure it was I a hot or something. So. Yeah. You know, I, I, I'm not all that well versed on all the different uh, the nomenclature of the okay. the World War One material. I, 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 I do enjoy making this stuff, but I'm by no means an expert. <laughs> right. Cool. Uh, obviously, Brickmania track links. Um, anything else? Yeah, this is cool. I mean, many the of color the scheme is Brick, awesome. Brickmania fans may remember that we had this tank. We've made the FT before. It was all gray. Uh, we we held off doing the camouflage because it, it costs a little more. And, and true to form, we did the camouflage because people asked for it, and it's going to be a little more expensive than the previous version of this kit. Uh, basically, it's, this, it's a redo. It's pretty much the same exact model, sure. just different colors. Um, one thing that is different is we didn't provide the tank commander in this one. You can't actually put the guy inside. Right. So no real reason to do it. So instead, Lando made us yeah. a new figure. Just finished this up today. It is a World War One. U.S. Infantry. So this is a real simple, real simple infantry figure that we're putting together. Uh, one thing it does not have, we have the, what, the M1903A4 sniper rifle, right. which is actually a World War II rifle. Um, but we have some exciting news that uh, Will from Brick Arms has told us today that yeah. he's going to make us some actual M1903 rifles, World War I rifles. Um, so you'll be able to get those first from Brickmania. Right, in uh, this set only. He's cutting the mold. So fingers crossed we don't have any problems where we we'll actually be able to, pr to deliver those with this kit. Um, they are going to be hand injected. Uh, that'll be a nice little freebie extra that you'll get with this kit. So new figure, kind of a bonus. So you'll get the tank, you'll get a soldier. Um, all for the one low price of one arm and one leg. I don't right. know about that, but... Yeah. <laughs> okay. Something like one that. arm and one leg! <laughs> Cool. All right. Um, anything else? Uh, I'm sorry if we insulted any French people in the making of this video. The Renault. Yeah. Renault. <laughs> Renault. The Renault. All right. Cool. All right. Thank you very much for watching. And thank you for buying our products.